guys, I finally got a new tub to keep my hair in, and to celebrate I thought I would make one of these. I've seen them before on Amazon, but I didn't really want to pay that price, so I decided to make my own. They're really easy, here's how you can make one too. To make your own hair tunnel, you are going to need some hair, some forage, and some tapioca flour. You'll also need a tunnel like from any pet store. Finally, you'll need a paintbrush and a heat safe container. I used a measuring cup, but you can also use scales. Measure out one part tapioca to two parts water to make your glue. This is pet safe and how you'll stick the hair to your tunnel. Add hot but not boiling water and stir well. The water I used was way too hot and it led to this kind of lumpy mixture. If you use hot but not boiling water, your glue will look something like this, kind of like watery PVA glue. Next, we're going to chop up your hair. Take a pair of scissors and cut the hair into small pieces. The smaller the better, as this will help the hair stick better to the tunnel. Next, add your forage and chop the mixture up again. I put down some baking paper to contain the mess, but you can spread out your hair mixture onto any surface. Now for the fun part. Grab your tunnel and start covering the surface in your tapioca glue. This can be a little messy, so you might want to wear gloves, as the glue is really sticky. Hopefully your glue won't be quite as lumpy as mine. Pick up your tunnel and roll it glue side down into the hair. Make sure to press down firmly so the small pieces of hair can stick to the tunnel. Repeat this over the entire surface of the tunnel. When you're finished, tap off the excess. Then you can go back over and fill out any spots that you've missed with some more glue and hair. You can leave your tunnel to air dry overnight, or you can put it in the oven on a low temperature, around 100 degrees, for 10 to 15 minutes to let it dry. I actually did a second coating of hair to make sure I filled out all the gaps. This is how the tunnel looked when it was finished. Let's see what the piggies think. love the hair tunnel and I think we'll definitely be doing this DIY again. Thanks so much for watching and we'll see you next time. Bye!